keep that in mind when you're going to the next thing. So what's our next... Advanced situational awareness involves the observation of human behavior to discern the details of any given tactical environment. Students are trained to perceive patterns in body language, geographics, atmospherics, and other realms in order to gain knowledge of key figures, tension levels, and probable targets. They're having an argument right now. All right, now the bull is out arguing too. Mola's out oh, arguing too with him. Uh, so really what we're aiming for here is how to think in a predictive manner and see what's going to happen left of the bang is what we call it instead of after something happens. Today's exercise sees actors playing out a scenario in a simulated village on the far end of the field. It is left to the students to determine what that scenario is and where the threats will likely come from if asked to intervene. All right, we got the black guy, red headdress right in front of the building that was flying the black Sighting flag. on Volcano Top. The majority of this training, I'd say 85 to 90 percent, is from the OPs. We have four observation posts out here and a talk. The observation posts go anywhere from 400 to 1,000 meters. The Army has increased their commitment to situational awareness training this year by providing physical improvements to the ASA course. Where there was once just a handful of temporary structures, there is now a complete village. We've added about roughly 30 additional uh, buildings in improving the village to add to the cognitive realism that we have to get the students in the frame of mind more that, hey, this isn't just some range that we're going to. We're watching this village take place in their daily life. We're watching it from a distance. And our brain very soon doesn't know the difference between it being fake and it's being real by the additions that we've made. The new buildings were carefully laid out so to create different blind spots for each observation post. This requires students to effectively communicate between OPs in order to collectively clear the area. Uh, we've also improved the actual observation posts. What we were used to using on the prone in the dirt, we used to observe from there. We've built up to two and even three stories to be able to change levels uh, and change views to view from different places as well. ASA Basic is a five-day course totaling 50 hours with students rotating in throughout the year. David Wright. Fort Benning TV.